the next one web camera so it was first developed in 1991 so it was pointed uh, at the trojan room coffee pot in cambridge university the camera was finally switched off on august 22 2001 the final image can be captured on its home page in 2004 so it is the oldest web camera which is uh, still operating which has been running continuously till 1994 so this uh, started everything started with the cambridge university in the computer science department a webcam is a device used to capture images audio and video okay webcam are either inbuilt or can be externally attached to the laptop or a computer you know all these things so in a uh, modern day laptops your webcam is completely inbuilt right the most common application of webcam is a video chat video recording or image capturing so webcam generally consists of a lens then image sound sensor the electronic circuit to process the data and send it to the pc so it is going to have all these lenses for focusing image and sound sensor for capturing your image and as well as your uh, voice and electronic circuits i have to mix the image and sound in such a way that the sync is not completely uh, missed out and it is sent to the pc for processing so a lot of webcams with different uh, variations are available in the market so depending on the feature and quality the technology used and the prices are going to vary however the basic function remains the same the basic function of uh, recording the sound along with the image is going to be the same so you will want a webcam system with a high uh frame rate when you are going to stream a video so frame rate you know it is uh, i as we have seen it is between 0 to 30 and at least 15 frames per second you need for uh, videos and if you have high frame to achieve high frame rate you need a high speed internet connection so once it captures a frame the software broadcasts the image over your internet connection so it will immediately transfer the image over the internet connection So webcam photo turns an image into JPEG file and uploads in the FTP server. You can easily place a JPEG image on any web page. So you can even configure a web camera to uh, upload your file either to an FTP and transfer it to a remote location, or you can ask it to save it as a JPEG file. So in principle, digital camera is similar to traditional film-based camera. That is, you you have a lens to focus the image. some means by which several images can be stored and removed for it you will have a hard disk right in the inside the hard disk whatever data you capture is going to be stored so whatever data you capture is going to be stored inside the hard disk so digital photography techniques are there you can use it to enhance the images so although the principle may be same as the film camera in the digital camera it is quite different because it is going to use cmos or uh, ccd cmos is complementary metal oxide semiconductor or ccd is charge coupled device it is going to be the uh, technology which is used for the sensors so each sensor element converts light into an voltage proportional to the brightness which is passed to an ecd converter which translates the fluctuations on the ccd into a binary cod So you have a webcam, and you can see that it will have. Uh, you can either store it in a PC with audio, image, and the PC with a disk will give the instructions on how to store them. And you will have a USB connection from the webcam, which will be interfaced with your personal computer. The webcam uh, typically include a lens at the top, an image sensor at the bottom, and supporting security as shown in the. So this is going to be the lens. This is going to be the sensor, image sensor. So this is the CCTV camera, and now the light is going to pass. So assume that the digital output of ADC is sent to the DST, which adjusts the contrast and detail and compresses the image before sending it to storage. See again, when you are going to store this image, you have to compress it and store because whenever you are going to store it as it is, it is going to consume a very very huge amount of memory. So you have to always compress and store the image whatever you capture. So the brighter the light, the higher the voltage, and the brighter the resulting computer pixel. More elements, the higher the resolution. Later is the detail which can be captured. Okay, so advanced webcam features you have motion sensing. More nowadays with cameras are used for uh, taking a picture, new picture when it detects motion. Image archiving you can create archive archive means all the previous uh, stored images you can archive it. Video messaging some webcams support video messaging also. 
advanced connections you can uh, connect your web camera to home theater or av equipment of your house automation robotic cameras will help you in uh, uh, setting that uh, tilt positions uh, based on the position of the camera streaming media for professional applications a webcam setup ca can use uh, mpeg4 compression to achieve true streaming audio and video you can use it for streaming uh, media files using the web camera custom coding you can use import your com co co computer you can write code and you can instruct the webcam what to do that can also be done switch on the webcam at a particular time switch off the webcam at a particular time capture only when required so those software code also you can write it and you can uh, uh inspect the webcam on what to do and one example of custom coding is automatically refreshing of the image so that is uh, done nowadays and uh, you will be out of town for a week and you want to keep an eye on your house you will definitely need web cameras you will be to check whether everything is okay at work so you need to check whether your see, all your household activities you can you, everything can be made possible by just installing a web camera in your house okay next one is webcam networking so you can get the software which will allow your video phone to call your friend now it may be a normal call or it may be a video conferencing call or you can even have a video interview and broadcast it live some webcam will deliver images directly to your pdas so some will let you to connect your camcorder so other possibilities are in let's see it's just like plug and play only all the features are available only thing you select what is applicable for you so this is a simple example of video conferencing parallelly going with the presenter and along with the presentation presenter presentation and the meeting people multiple locations if you have a video conferencing you can you can see them simultaneously using the a technique simultaneously you can see them using the web cameras same thing here you can see multiple team meetings are happening at the same time you can place a standard camera anywhere in the house and run a cable from the camera to the computer so this camera will store all the data in the computer hard disk of the computer Okay, less than you can find the security cameras for less than dollar hundred nowadays. It, is, it has become commercialized and customized. The price also become very very stable. So household users you can install cameras and you can see what is happening. This is the camera in a, in a place that a street the camera is placed. Some software and app for video chatting and conferencing. You have the Skype. So just for starters, you can instant message with anyone or your contact using to hundred of people. You can organize a video call or conference call. You can have a get together and you can search a perfect venue for that. One such application is going to be Skype. This is a simple example where you can meet everyone virtually online using Skype. And the camera, you can uh, use the front or back camera to see the corresponding picture. Next one is IMO. So IMO is uh, for uh, call, chat, call, share, all in one place. So you can make video call, you can chat, and you can share the videos and uh, images here in one place. So this is a very, very another popular uh, software application other than Skype. Next one, you have Google Duo, which will help you in doing video calls. Okay. And it will have a very high crystal quality, and it is uh, promoted by Google and all the Google phones will have Google Duo application by default. So this is all about webcam.